Welcome back to another episode of the Hermit Poetry Series. I'm Neil Aiken, and on this channel I read poetry, mostly work by contemporary poets, occasionally poems of my own, and once in a while poems from the past. Today's poem comes to us from Roy G. Guzman, uh, from a collection entitled Catrachos, published by Ray Wolf Press in 2020. Uh, this poem is entitled Midwestern Skulls for the Broken Latino. People who crave the jaw and not the fox's gentle tail, his landmine of teeth, a temporary exit for those who yearn to return to the coyote's tent to reclaim their belongings, the chopped head, the neck before it was plucked from the rest of the body like a hen's for dinner, antique shops for raccoons' clawed feet, a necklace for women in labor. After the snow melts, the dead return to their natural habitats, eyes barely shut under the charcoal, whiskers trapped in the pine cones. Some secrets are better rolled into the mouths of strangers while they sleep. A father can make up suffering seasons, leave in the afternoon, then sneak in through a windless frame, though these too can be called winter and fall and held by a child's contemptuous hands in a garden where only the wind can be torn from branches. Did they really mean to us to leave us shipwreck these those sailors who recognize flesh, but not what flesh can camouflage? People covet the mandible as it's handed down for all to drink from. In his hands I appear dead, but here, here in my chest is where my father finds the new continent of directions measured in forgiveness. I sleep in the wilderness, like a fox loitering in a frozen meadow, and I'll feed him forgiveness if he asks. And that was Roy G. Guzman uh, from Catrachos, published by Grey Wolf Press in 2020. If you enjoyed this reading and this poem, please do check out the description of the video for more information about Roy G. Guzman and more information about the book, um, Catrachos and where to purchase that uh, from Grey Wolf Press. Uh, you can also find a list of other projects and series I'm currently working on. Um, I'm grateful for the opportunity to continue to produce these videos and hope in some small way that by, by sharing these videos, sharing these poems, and celebrating these poets, that this expands your experience with poetry and enables even more people to discover these poets, these poems, and perhaps kindle within them a desire to write, to create, to participate in the larger conversation of art and literature. So here's to each of you that are continuing to do that, and here's to uh, those who will find these videos in the future. I hope you are excited about these poems and fascinated by these poets and come to discover them uh, one poet, one poem at a time. And uh, if you want to support this channel, just hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, or comment below with your own suggestions or comments about these videos. And uh, if you'd like, you can share these on social media. Just share the links and that also helps spread the word. All this just draws more attention to the poets and the poems, and that really ultimately is all I'm looking for in this channel. Uh, so, until next time, stay safe and well. We'll be back every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, and so we'll see you again soon. Until then, keep reading, keep writing, keep being part of the good work of poetry and art in fostering a world in which we can come to understand and to rejoice in each other and to look forward in the future to more opportunities to learn to to learn to draw to to become closer i think um, as a human family uh, one experience at a time one creative expression at a time uh, and whether that's through shared grief or shared discovery or shared wonder uh, that we can accomplish that. So we'll see you again soon. Take care and uh, goodbye.